What is up guys? It's the Magic Man. We are back in the studio finally. It's been a while. It's been a while. We've been pretty busy. Like everything is just, everything's just back to normal. Been out shooting events. <laughs> But yeah, we're back in the studio and we will be talking about the new LG Dual Up Ergo Monitor. It might be the weirdest monitor I've ever used or tested. I think uh, it's better if I show you, right? Let me just... Yep. Just let me... Ow. Hold on. Now this, this is the Ergo Arm. If you're not aware, I did do a 32 inch ultra fine Ergo monitor review, which I will link over here to the left side or on the description below. This is the Ergo Arm. What I love about this, it's just plug and play, like out of the box. You just have to clamp it using this. It's gigantic, but there. And it has different levels where you can just Put it up your desk here and it fits most of the desks which i think is pretty neat there you go i'm not sure if it's the is it the middle and now this arm just goes all the way around see ooh, 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 ooh. you can also tighten the pressure or of the weight because it just retracts back up now when i say weirdest monitor this is really a head turn and i'll show you here i'll be back again just real quick I mean, what kind of sorcery is this? It's a, it's square. Now we're gonna use the clamp at the back here and we will just fit it out right there. Ooh, I haven't done this yet. Ah, refreshing. So you can move this around, very flexible. It goes all the way around. This is what I love about the Ergo stand. You know, I've never been a fan of ultra wide monitors, but now we go tall. It's super square, but I think it's cool. Now let's talk about this real quick. First, it's an IPS panel, a nano IPS panel, which is good for when I work. You know, you get crisp and clear uh, images. Basically, it's two 1440p monitors stacked together. 16 by 18 aspect ratio. Honestly, I think it's a dream for designers or coders or for me as a content creator or a photographer, I get to split two screens. I mean, if you're a multitasker, I think this is the way to go, right? Let me just show you the back here real quick. Real, 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 real quick. You have an upstream USB-C for when you want to charge and use the monitor with your laptop. You also have two USB 3.0 downstreams, display port in, a USB upstream, a headphone jack, DC in, and two HDMI 2.0 ports. What separates this from the rest of the monitors out there is, well, other than how it looks, the arm. The Ergo arm is designed, you know, you can work efficiently with this one. You can tilt, swivel, and pan. So tilt, tilt down, tilt up, and then you get to swivel, just like how I showed you. Well, let me just stand up here. You can swivel all the way around here and all the way back here. You can also rotate clockwise there are 90 degrees clockwise other than having 16 by 18 aspect ratio you can go 18 by 16. no <laughs> maybe i should get my computer and plug it in here brb i should be over there oh i didn't turn it on because it's not plugged in okay i thought i broke it it comes with this really big power brick. Like, it gets bigger and bigger. I'm gonna plug this in. <laughs> what is wrong with me? It does make a sound. Bing! It's pretty bright too, huh? I'll just reposition everything so that you guys can see the monitor, okay? BRB. Or let's just do this. No, that doesn't work. <laughs> Check your system preferences lg sd qhd 60 hertz it does have hdr let's check it real quick okay it's pretty decent you have a 3840 by 2160 2560 by 28 
80, 20, 48 by 20, 304, and the list goes on. If you go to 19, 20 by 10, 80, it's gonna look... <laughs> So to the recommended resolution, which is this. We're gonna check out a few things. Let's go to Chrome, go to YouTube. Oh my gosh. No, it's not touchscreen. I'm just doing this for effect. <laughs> it looks like you have two screens. Playing something over here. You go full screen on this. So it's good. weird with uh, this kind of frame because you have like big black bars up and down here. Cool, you can see uh, it's at 60 hertz, smooth. For browsing, I'm not gonna lie, it is comfortable. I can watch something up there and, you know, read down here. It's like having two screens. If you ask me, I do have both the 32-inch Ergo ultrafine monitors on my current setup, which is in the other studio. If you don't want to spend for two monitors, you can have this, it's two in one. In ultra wide monitors, you go left and right. Here, you can just look at one, fire up probably Photoshop. You can work comfortably, you can view your pictures. What if this is in full screen? <laughs> That's just a lot of room to like, edit your photo. Look at that. Let's fire up a uh, Lightroom here. Now you can do things more efficiently. I kind of like it. It's so easy to navigate and go through your photos. As for me, it's not your usual monitor. Normally when I shoot in the studio, I do have another monitor that I tilt vertically if I want to shoot for reels or shorts. And then when it's landscape, you still have enough space for viewing, going through your images. It's fantastic. I mean, first it was weird, but now it's just like, looks normal to me. Colors per se, they are again vibrant, it's sharp if you're a consumer or you just don't want to stress yourself and you just want something out of the box, have those colors that you want. This is it right here. Okay, now that we're done viewing Photoshop and Lightroom, let's check out Final Cut. Now this I am excited to see. Look at that space in terms of a timeline, you see everything down here. And if you just minimize this one, you have a lot of space to view your content. And if you want to like edit something vertically, you can do that as well. Oh my gosh, here we go. You have a lot of room to view everything. Usually you have the timeline and the viewer to the right and the browser to the left. That's just amazing. If you have like a big project going on, you can see the timeline. Everything about this monitor is just, should I say, magical. <laughs> Looking at it right now, it's you would want to use something like this every day. Oh my gosh, look at that. The best way to consume media for me. Let's check out the calendar. Boom. You know, you can edit photos on top, you can watch your favorite shows, and you can edit videos down here. <laughs> this feels so weird, but it's so good. In terms of the sound, like you have to have the Allen wrench. With the Ergo arm, I can work like this. Or like this. Sure like I had I glasses back then. This before. is like the old, this is where I used to sh do my shoots before. Cool. Oh, speaking of games, check this out. It's called the picture by picture. So it activates both the HDMI one or whatever input device you have. It can be the USB-C or the display port. So when you click on that, You have two screens in one. Look at this, you can play God of War. Do something different. You can attach another computer or another PC or anything. So now you can play. Can I switch the, these two? Main screen, change. <laughs> you can switch HDMIs. Oh my God, I sound too excited. Watch your shows or work. And, and you can even change the sound input. It's one of a kind. I've never seen anything like it before. But the question now is, how does it look like when you want to game? Will it have bars? Ah! The recommended resolution is 2560 by 2800. It's safe to say that this monitor is really not for gaming, but for the ultimate productivity experience, I think this is the one. This is it. What if I want to tilt it? Will it make any difference? Uh, 270 degrees, there you go. Okay, if you don't want 16 by 8 by 18 ratio, you can go 18 by 16 or 16 ratio. It's still cool. There's no difference. I prefer this one. I prefer the right uh, vertical aspect ratio. 
that was quite the preview of this fantastic monitor. I would recommend this monitor for people who, number one, do love the real estate, do love this aspect ratio. I mean, this is a new aspect ratio even for me. It's not really weird or absurd. Number two, this monitor is probably for those who love to multitask. I mean, I love to multitask myself. You know, you have that picture by picture. You have decent input outputs, have out of the box accurate colors. But the best part about having this unique monitor is the Ergo Arm. I said it in my last video and I will say it again. It should come with all the monitors LG produces. The last one is this monitor is for those who just want to stand out. Very different. You don't go wide, you go tall. I love every thing about it. I think I have to replace my monitor setup soon. Huge, huge shout out to LG Philippines for sending over the LG Dual Up Ergo Monitor. It's been fantastic. It's perfect. Sakto, it's the holidays. It's almost Christmas. Maybe it's time to do an upgrade or, you know, you can gift this to someone. Do check out the LG Philippines official store in Lazada or in different e-com sites. Thank you guys for watching. Hit like, subscribe, and share. Don't forget, it's the magic man because now you see me, now you don't.